All right, so we decided to order some women's best activewear. Um, so we got the Power Seamless leggings. I got mine in this like aqua color. Um, so here's the thing. One, this entire set was less than $100. It was super, super affordable. Um, I actually really like how it fits. I think it's really flattering for a seamless legging. Um, it has like very, like it has like um, accent that runs underneath the booty um, and all the way down the leg. Uh, again, a seamless sports bra. Uh, this is what the back looks like. It's super cute. I, I love this color. This color is so cute, especially with a tan. Um, here's the thing with the women's best order. One, it was a $50 customs charge, which again, like I've, I've mentioned this in the Shein haul um, kind of updates that I've been doing. It's just like, <laughs> it's, it's frustrating when they're like, oh, free shipping or when you do pay for shipping and then you're getting dinged at customs. And like, it was $50 for customs. That's like pretty much the, co the, the cost of this entire outfit was like 50 bucks. I think each piece was like $30. So to pay equal value in customs charges is just incredibly frustrating. Um, okay, so that aside, um, here's my criticisms and why I don't really love uh, what I got from Women's Best. One, you can't really see because I'm wearing like a seamless nude underwear. But when I tell you that these are see-through, they're see-through. Like I would never, ever, 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 even on an uh, upper body day, wear these leggings to the gym. They are that see-through. They're like, I'll work out, the, with, work out with them at home, but I will never wear them out of this house. Um, it's not worth sending back. Like the cost of returning them isn't worth it. So I'll keep them because like, they look cute on camera. They're cute for home workouts, but like, they're see-through, especially where this um, like accenting is. It's a thinner, it's a thinner material, and it is like yeah, you can't really tell. It's it's see-through. Like me and Renee were wearing these to work out together, and it's like, yep, there she is. <laughs> like it's it's see-through. Um, so that's number one. Number two is, I, I have a bra on, but the pads that came in the sports bra, again, across the board, I usually hate them, but to say they were cheap is an understatement. They were obnoxiously crappy quality, which, you know, the sports bra was like 25 bucks, so whatever, but it is what it is. I just want, you know, to give a full rundown of how I feel about it. Um, then there was the customs charges, and then the other thing is, is the branding that is on the outfit. It's this like iron on, if you can see, like an iron on like sticker. And I've worn this a couple of times working out at home and it's already starting to peel off. Like I could, I could pick this off. Um, again, it wasn't super expensive, but we did get it on sale. So it's not like their stuff is like, you know, super cheap. Wait for a sale if you're interested. Um, yeah, those are, that's just how I feel about it. It's see-through. The branding isn't gonna, like a couple more washes as branding is gonna start to peel off. Uh, beware of the customs charges. Um, you you actually get a phone call from FedEx. It doesn't even leave, I think, Germany or something um, before you pay $50 in customs charges. And me and Renee bought it together, so that was for two outfits. Um, and then yeah, super, super, super see-through. So there you go. Okay, it's my turn. So I ordered this bubblegum pink. I love the color, super, super cute. I just wanna just draw attention to the top part. So when Nikki was talking about the, the liners that come in it, this is, I'm not sure what it's like, this one looks like I've got an abnormally large, well, yeah, anyway, I'll let you use your imagination. I'm just gonna pull them out so I can show you. I am wearing a bra underneath. Okay, so without width, obviously we're gonna take them without. And I'll show you how thin they are. So they're very thin and like, I don't know what it's, I don't know. Anyway, so this is the bubblegum pink one. I, like I said, I love the color. It's very, very cute. Um, but I'm with Nikki. As soon as you bend over, you can see all the gifts that God gave you. And we need to just keep that to ourselves. 
But I just want to share. So I actually ordered um, this pair, I think two years ago when I saw the brand. And these are actually one of my favorite workout leggings. They're the same, the power legging, everything about them is the same, except the material. So these are very, very see-through, like Nikki had said, especially on the, the seamed areas. Um, but these ones that I have, I have another pair in black, same pattern, same everything. And these are not see-through. And even like the sticker, two years, it has not changed. It looks the same. So I feel like, I hate saying this because I hate bringing or saying negative things about a brand, but we're here to tell the truth. So two years ago, amazing. So I don't know what they've, what they've changed over the last two years. Um, I don't know Would I order these again, probably not, which is so sad because I was really hopeful that they were going to be like this. They even just feel different. The color is cute. If you just want to just bomb around, like Nikki said, do a home workout. And I actually feel like I ordered mediums and I just like to be more like, you know, put together. Um, and I feel like these are not so good. Anyway, that's my full review. Two years ago, badass pants. Now, not so good.